Are you are you are you are you are you race baiting? I think that's a, a really lazy uh, way of categorising asking questions about our constitutional arrangements. So Robert E. White he says that you've been constantly bashing Māori using racist rhetoric, racist propaganda, inciting racism in the populace to win votes from Pakia. What's your response? I think that's uh, a very lazy categorisation. Thank you. The Māori Party, though, they, they say they're upset by your questions and they say that you're upsetting Māori around the country as well with your questions. What, what's your response to that? Well, the Prime Minister needs to answer my questions. Do you, think, do you see how uncomfortable this might make Māori feel hearing themselves being talked about in Parliament in such a way that could be quite detrimental to the way that they feel and think about themselves? What I'd like all Māori to know that this is not talking about Māori. This is talking about constitutional arrangements. Isn't it essentially? Isn't she doing? Isn't this essentially what is in the treaty, which every New Zealander should know? I don't know that all New Zealanders would view what the Prime Minister is now talking about as uh, the treaty. They would see, I think, that this is a radical interpretation. What is the radical interpretation? The Māori Health Authority, is that what you're referring to? No, I suggest you think about all the other issues the, I've been the raising. Constitutional there, there matters? are constitutional arrangements that are clearly uh, in play at the moment, and the Prime Minister needs to They're be up front. Because you've brought them up, haven't aren't they? Because the Prime Minister is already undertaking a, uh, a stream of work, or her government is, that clearly is bringing about significant changes to ownership, uh, to governance, and we're now looking at what looks like a joint sovereignty. That is not something that I think most New Zealanders even realise. Isn't, 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 isn't that the partnership under Te Tiriti? Well, this is, these are questions I'm asking the Prime Minister. What does she mean by it? Didn't, didn't we have that? Didn't we have that? You should frame your questions in a different way, because the way you're framing them, the Māori Party clearly thinks, is divisive. Uh, no, I think the way I'm framing the questions are within standing orders. So no, whether they're technically OK according to standing orders. Do you think that you could uh, do them in a way that, that the other party feels is you know, less divisive? Parliament is a place of free speech within the rules. I will continue to ask the questions until the Prime Minister answers the questions directly. Do you think yes. the government do you think the government is conspiring to keep this um, to keep something from New Zealanders? Well it's pretty clear that the government doesn't want to have a full and frank discussion. Who do you mean when you say New Zealanders want to have a conversation? Because what the Māori Party is saying is that they don't feel part of that conversation. Very happy for the Māori Party to be part of that conversation. The Māori Party walking out, do you consider that to be a stunt? I think it's entirely up to them to answer that question.